As coronavirus sweeps across the country, there is a massive undertaking to counter it just as quickly. Operation Warp Speed, a public-private partnership aimed at developing a vaccine in record time. You know who's in charge of it? Honestly, I am. I'll tell you, I'm really in charge of it. Top health official Dr. Anthony Fauci is part of the team and says research is in the early trial stages. But if all goes well, a vaccine could be ready for distribution by January. We want to go quickly, but we want to make sure it's safe and it's effective. I think that is doable. Dr. Fauci also warning states not to move too quickly to open their economies. White House social distancing guidelines expire tonight, and 25 states will be in some phase of reopening by tomorrow. You can't just leap over things and get into a situation where you're really tempting a rebound. That's the thing I get concerned about. New unemployment numbers out today show another 3.8 million Americans filed first-time jobless claims last week, bringing the six-week total to more than 30 million new claims, though the actual number is likely much higher as overwhelmed unemployment offices struggle to keep up. I have tried unemployment. I have tried the SBA loan. And unfortunately, none of those things have panned out as of yet. Experts believe unemployment will finally begin to level off as states reopen. We came into this uh, period of unemployment by a very different path than, say, in the Great Recession, and, and we'll go out by a different path. Optimism from Washington as the country faces an uncertain future. In one hopeful sign, the Navy hospital ship, the USNS Comfort, left New York City today one month after it was sent to relieve stress on hospitals during the height of the pandemic.